Hi, my name is Ashish and in this video we will see what is Azure private DNS and how to create a private zone. So let me just quickly log on to the portal and take it from there. Okay, I'm logged on to the portal. So before we proceed with the creation of Azure private DNS, let me tell you a little bit of what actually is Azure private DNS. The domain name system or DNS as we all know is responsible for resolving a service name to its IP address. So Azure DNS is a hosting service for DNS domains providing name resolution using the Microsoft Azure infrastructure. Azure Private DNS provides a reliable, secure DNS service to manage and resolve domain name in a virtual network without the need to add a custom DNS solution. By using private DNS zones, we can use our own custom domain names rather than the Azure provided names available today. Using custom domain names would help us to tailor the virtual network architecture to best suit the organization needs. It will also provide name resolution for virtual machines within a virtual network and between a virtual network. Additionally, we can configure zones names with a split horizon view which allows a private and public DNS zone to share the name. So to resolve the records of a private DNS zone from the virtual network, we must link the virtual network with the zone. Linked virtual networks have full access and can resolve all DNS records published in the private zone. Additionally, we can also enable auto registration on a virtual network link. If we enable auto registration on a virtual network link, the DNS records for the virtual machines on that virtual network are registered in the private zone. When auto registration is enabled, Azure DNS also updates the zone records whenever a virtual machine is created, changes its IP address or is deleted. So before I go with the, uh, with you know explaining a bit of theory about what actually is Azure Private DNS, let me show you how to create a private DNS zone and side by side, I'll tell you the features of it as well. So to create the private DNS zone, you click on create a resource and type private DNS zone. Click on create. Right, so resource group, let us create a new one. Test other private DNS RSG. Right, and let's keep it in East US and you can put the name uh, whatever you want. So let's say I don't private dot other dot XYZ or whatever name you want, right? And it says that you can link virtual networks to private the DNA zone after the zone has been created. I don't want tags. running the validation and I'm going to click on create so it's initializing the deployment it may take a few minutes to create the zone and I will pause the video and come back okay the deployment is complete now I'm going to go to my resource and you see here so if I if you take want to take it further let's create a virtual network Okay, and then we'll link the virtual network to the private DNS zone. So let it come up. Okay. I'm going to create a virtual network. I will do, I'm sorry, virtual network. Click create resource group. I'm going to create in it in the private one. A virtual network name. Let's my VNet East US IP address spaces. 
let's go with the default security everything would be disabled review create and i'm going to click on create it's initializing the deployment as soon as it is done i'm going to link the virtual network right so i hope this was informative to all of you guys i'll make a separate video wherein we'll link this once and i'll tell you more features about the private dns zone as well so if you have any queries please mention them in the comment section and i'll see you guys in the next video thank you have a good day